Now, face coverings are federally mandated. Please ensure your face coverings over your nose and mouth there, at all times. We still have the boarding I know. I, I was just okay. So I'll, I'll wear that one. But like your face coverings. Just let us know. We can rearrange. Uh, another way of transportation for you to get to Tampa. Excuse me. Um, I'll, I'll wear this, but if, if she can give me a reason, like, did I have to turn it off? Like, is there a reason? Like, it's offensive. It's offensive? It can be to some people, so we're not gonna go, we're not gonna go back and forth. Just go ahead and put the blue one on, okay? Okay, so my mask is offensive. That's fine, do I know, I'm, I was just asking a question. I'm, I'm not okay. being confrontational. It's just... So, we're gonna put the blue one on, right? Yes. That's it. Sure. Wow. This is not America anymore. This is not America anymore. I was told that I need to turn off my mask, okay? That says, let's go Brandon on it. And my shirt is fine though. The mask is not. The shirt says the same thing as the mask. And I was told to turn it off by the flight attendant. I'm wearing it right now. And you did not change it the first time. They yes, I did. You changed it when I asked you. I asked you to change it. This and you, you asked it. if I was going to keep it on, and I said flight, yes. Ma'am, I talked to the pilot. And, the and pilot I said yes. Ma'am, the pilot and the flight Under what, what conditions? Because they don't feel comfortable with you on the aircraft. Because I'm wearing a mask because like you told me drama. to? What? I'm sitting here. I haven't done anything. Ma'am, I need you. I out. literally have just put my mask I on. I can do that, but I don't understand under what conditions. for Denver, the passenger's refusing to come off and she's fil filming me. Yes, I will film you because it's ridiculous. Okay. Do you have a Does that mean some sort of certification that's different than this? Yeah, it, 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 it's it's not specified in the thing. We go by what, what, what's allowed on the airplane. I'll pass it on to the cabin. You walked all the way back here without a mask over your nose. What's the difference? You're going to have to come off the airplane. They're not going to let you travel. What? Non-mask compliance. So I can't fly because this doesn't work? Correct. I'm, asking, I'm here to ask you a question. Did he just get kicked off for wearing it, a mask? It's between bites and sticks, sir. You have to put your mask on. Did he just get kicked off sir, for wearing a mask? I don't know what's mask. going on, but I'm, I'm asking you. It has to be in between bites and sticks. That's the federal law, okay? Sip. Now I'm biting now, you. I'm now biting. Put it, no, now put it back on. Now put your mask on. Did he just on. get kicked off for sir, wearing a mask? I don't know what's I'm going out of here. On. Forget it. I'm out of here. You know this whole thing is ridiculous. Wow. It's not my law, sir. It's the federal government's law. Take it up with him. I think the best way to illustrate absurdity is with absurdity. Jenny says he's worn underwear as a mask since the beginning of the pandemic. People started following, just filing off the plane. Maybe a dozen, something like that. It happened after this guy questioned why Jenny got removed. Then he says others followed his lead. Thank you to them because they saw something, an injustice, something that didn't make sense, and they stood up. Afterwards, Jenny received this email from United Airlines saying he's now banned from United flights until his case has been reviewed by the Passenger Incident Review Committee. We took the time to go look at United Airlines' website. It simply says that your mask should not have any vents or holes in it, and it should fully cover your nose and mouth. Jenny tells me he feels like his underwear mask did meet those guidelines, but of course, United Airlines did not.